ஹலோ ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் சமக்ர சிக்ஷா சித்தி பேட் ப்ரெசன்ட்ஸ் அவர் வேர்ல்ட் த்ரூ இங்கிலீஷ் கிளாஸ் செவன் பேஜ் எயிட்டி ஒன் லிசனிங் அண்ட் ஸ்பீக்கிங் யுவர் டீச்சர் வில் ரீட் த ஸ்டோரி கலிவர் இன் லிலிபுட் லிசன் கேர்ஃபுல்லி அண்ட் ஆன்சர் த ஃபாலோயிங் கொஸ்டின்ஸ் பேஜ் 137 appendix 1 texts for listening unit 5 gulliver in lilliput gulliver was a doctor on a ship he was an englishman there was a bad storm and the ship hit a rock and broke into two pieces It was a night time however Gulliver swam forward and at last reached an island called Lilliput The people were called Lilliputians Gulliver was too tired he could not open his eyes he soon went to sleep Next morning when he woke up he could not move he was held down by some ropes his long hair was also pinned to the ground then something climbed on to his leg and came up to his chin it was a little man about 15 cm high he carried a bow and an arrow in his hand then Forty more little people climbed onto Gulliver's body. He was very surprised and gave a loud shout. Immediately, all the little men ran away. But they came back soon. At first, the ropes were too strong for him to break. But somehow, after a long struggle, Gulliver broke some of them he could move one of his arms when they saw this the little people shouted and shot their little arrows into him but the arrows did not hurt gulliver very much they were like little pins gulliver lay still he did not move After some time the little people stopped shooting arrows at him Gulliver asked for some food over a hundred people brought baskets full of meat and loaves of bread Gulliver ate them and fell asleep the little men took Gulliver to their king the king liked Gulliver very much He told his officers to take Gulliver to the biggest building in the land. No house was big enough for Gulliver to live in, but he was able to creep inside the building and lie down. The beds were too small for Gulliver, so they took hundreds of beds and joined them together. Gulliver lived among the little people for some time. He wanted to go home. Fortunately, one day Gulliver found a boat floating near the seashore. He sailed out to sea in that boat. Later, a big ship found him and took him back to England.